Hey guys, it's Ozia, and um, I want to show you guys a uh, another power solution. Um, unlike the Minecraft Drill uh, automatic tree farm, which uh, if you click there, you can go and see that. Uh, this one's for producing uh, EU power. Um, this one's a small setup, so essentially you've just got a recycler, a generator, a bat box, and this igneous extruder from Thermal Expansion. Uh, the igneous extruder, with the power of lava and water, th these never go down, um, create coal stone. If you choose stone or obsidian, that's when they start using the lava. But essentially it's an infinite cobblestone generator. And when it outputs, it will output into an available inventory. In this case, it's the recycler. And the recycler will turn the cobblestone into scrap. And then the scrap will get pumped into the generator. It doesn't always uh, produce scrap. It's about a, a one in three chance, I think, uh, that produces scrap. But so it's a little bit wasteful, but it does produce power. As we can see here, the generators are almost full. The bat boxes are completely full. And the system itself is uh, fully expandable. Here we've got, uh, have we got, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So 13 or so. And uh, what I've got here is I've got these uh, automatic wooden pipes and gates attached to them. So they automatically pump out of the recycler. And then they get pumped in across into these insertion pipes, which automatically fill the generators. And then over here, any extra scrap that I'm not burning. Uh, nine of the scrap turns into a scrap box. Scrap boxes are great because uh, if you just uh, throw them on the ground or right quick you get random stuff with all of them. So apart from creating energy they're also a good source of getting uh, random stuff like rubber, there's chicken, there's a, a spade there, apple, I think there's tin, there's a plant ball. You can get glowstone, so and you can get neverack, so you don't even need to go to the nether to get that stuff anymore. Uh, this stuff will, or this will do it from the get-go. So just to build these things, first of all, you're going to need a recycler, uh, and then you're going to need a igneous extruder. Put that on top, and the igneous extruder should be set to output at the bottom of that orange. Get rid of these. Then you need to put water in the, ex the extruder and then lava and then when it lights up you know it's working. So it's working, it's pumping the cobblestone into the recycler. And then what you need to do is you need to build a generator. And then what you need to do is you need to pump, I need to, uh, you need to turn that around. Turn that way. You need to pump uh, what's all the scrap out of the recycler uh, when it actually gets turned on. So we'll just get that started. And then you're going to need to have an output from the generator. If I've got a bat box. Yep. Yeah. I think I've got to go from this way. Nope, wrong way. This way. There we go. Oh, my bad. I need to put a, uh, some power in there first. So let's just get some coal. So this system does need uh, just a tiny bit of initialization power. Like that. Nope, this way. There we go. And we can see here that it's now turning that stuff in the scrap. Scrap's getting pumped out into the generator, and then the generator is then burning it, turning into that into the in the bat box. And so while I said that it only turns like one three, one out of three cobblestone into scrap right, and so it's a little bit wasteful, um, 
I've done the calculations. Uh, in the end, you eventually generate more power than what you use. And as you can see, if we just uh, look at this one, uh, 40,000, if we just, uh, is this the right way? You can see it quickly goes up, 300, 400, 500. So essentially, uh, you can use this to power quite a lot of stuff, but from the get-go, it's a pretty good power source. Um, you can also put overclocker upgrades in here to turn the scrap faster, just so it can keep up with the Ignis extruder. Uh, I wouldn't recommend any more than one, because the, you actually uh, increase the amount of power that the recycler uses, plus um, it's one will essentially be as fast as the Ignis extruder is. So. Uh, until next time guys, um, please like, comment and subscribe, uh, check out some of my other videos if you want to uh, look at some of the other power solutions such as my um, automatic farms and automatic tree farms, uh, anything else like that, so until next time guys, nah.